safety and everything. This is the Bolt EV, which I've always really enjoyed. Um, I, I'm not sure. Oh, this is for the 2LT. But I believe this is supposed to start at $26,000 uh, this year. Um, and that plus a tax credit. Um, There's been some debate on that, if the pricing is going to stay the same with the tax credit in place. Oh, you think that they would jack up the price so that it would then come back down to the original? We'll have to take a look. Uh, I've always liked the Bolt, though, to be honest with you. I think it's had uh, always had great range. You know, easily like a 250 mile uh, plus vehicle. Good space. I'm not sure I would want the uh, the bigger EUV or whatever it's called. I actually like the standard. Well, bolt. They, you say it's bigger, and it is physically bigger. Yeah. But the storage capacity overall is actually less. Yeah. Then, well, I would for sure get this one. Yeah. Then. Even more, that would make more sense. So. But. I think it, I think the big thing is it rides a little bit higher, and that's everybody wants that high seating position. Yeah. The Bolt EUV, um, which I just remember they use the CSS combo mm -hmm. standard. Um, Unlike the Leaf, which uses Chatamo, which is always a little bit silly. But yeah, Stefan was just saying that the EUV isn't actually that much bigger inside, so I would probably save the money and just get the quote-unquote smaller version. It just rides a touch higher. That's really yeah, the only yeah, thing I don't, it's got I don't going have for issues getting in and out of cars, uh, unlike Andrew. You know, he's a bit of an old man. He likes that kind of uh, ease of getting in and out. But I kind of dig this color, though. It's kind of this off silver uh, it's a pearl, champagne. pearlescent silver. Well, it's got kind of like a yellow, a hint of like yellow. It does, it does. To it. It's oh, kind of champagne-ish. Yeah.